Hey guys, what's up? Um, I'm making this quick little short video uh, to show you what to do if you're using version 5.0 of my tool. Um, in case you didn't see on Discord, there was a error on my part. I forgot a line of code that um, erases the export sheet. So uh, when you run the trait uh, edit tool, so what would happen is if you ran that trait edit tool first, um, it wouldn't erase what was exported. So then if you came behind it and ran your progression, uh, that information that was left over would still be in there and it was causing errors when you try to import it back into a uh, franchise. So I made a fix, version 5.1 is out, um, but anybody that has already started their franchise and has already gone through the first progression with their franchise, um, before you get to your regression stage, you're going to have to manually clear out that page. Um, it's hidden, so I'm going to show you guys how to do it. Um, once you clear it out, you can run your regression, everything will be fine, and then you can start with the new version 5.1 tool the following year, and you will not have any problems because the code has been added into the, the tray edit macro. So to do this, um, all you're going to do is you're going to open your progression tool, and... You're going to go and right click on the bottom. You're going to click on hide. And then you're going to go down all the way to the bottom to player table export. Okay. This is where um, anything we get exported that's a player table, all our information goes to here first. And then that's how it gets exported out to a, a separate file. Um, you're going to double click on that. As you can see, mine is clear. That's how it's supposed to look. As soon as you run a macro and it gets exported and saved, it's supposed to automatically clear out. Um, like I said, that was my, my bug that I had in it. I had forgot to add a, a line of code that actually cleared it out. So um, <clears throat> you're just going to select from A2, go all the way over here to KY, and then you're going to have to go down to, it's not going to show up for me because I don't have anything here, but you want to go all the way down to 300, 960, or 3,961. That's how far down the player table goes. You can go further than that. You can go all the way to 4,000 um, if you want. Bottom line, we just need to make sure everything gets cleared out. 3,961 3, is the lowest um, the player table goes. But anyways, so select all that. Just hit, oh, oops, forgot. Before you do that, review, unprotect sheet. Okay, now we're going to go back and do the same thing I just, I just said. Okay, so we'll select right here. We'll go all the way down to 3,961 3, or further because it doesn't matter. And then, like I said, we got to go all the way over to KY. Everything is selected right now. Just hit delete, and all that information will be gone that was in there. So now it's how it's supposed to be. Uh, so you can run your tool. Go ahead and hide this. Um, I don't suggest using the trade edit tool again this year, um, which you've actually already should have ran it twice since you've already done your progression. But regardless, just wait till you get to the new, um, the new 5.1 version to do that. But that's it. That's all. That's all you got to do. Um, you don't have to worry about protecting that sheet again. Just hide it one more time and then save your tool. Close it out, and you should be all ready for your regression um, phase with this one, and, and you should be, should be good to go. Um, that's it. So hopefully that will fix the problem for you.